Okay, so let's get rocking and rolling. If the opponent's gonna start, yes, they are. Okay, so we've just finished the focus targeting section, so now we're just looking at just again just the whole package of the answer process from my recent evaluations. Um, there was just a little little tweak of the targeting this is why we've um focused on the targeting again just reintroducing again reminding myself that the calculation comes before the targeting so don't target without any foundation so i think that's i lose the um I lose that element of calculation for targeting if you're playing the faster games you know you tend to just go well okay I know this so I don't need to calculate so this is why it's kind of bad playing those fast games bullet blitz and all that because you lose that element of proper calculation even a one two calculation is better than no calculation at all um, as a starting point but when you're just flicking around doing quick moves all you're doing is doing let's just attack this here uh, all you're doing is like knee-jerk reaction moves which are based on your pattern recognition that type of stuff but nothing else so there's no soul involved in it could go here but you know I'll give my king some company so that's the downside to playing the quick games you lose that proper focused calculated um, calculation to see whether or not it was the right right target or not. See, doing this, you see, all I want to do is open up the, and then get the rook start activated down here. But if we don't take, then it starts jumping in here. So I'm actually going to hit the bishop first. It's not castled yet, so we're giving them something to think about. I don't think he wants to castle that way, actually. Because he was willing to open this area up uh, again he wants to open up the king area so should we let him do that i think the bishop is just going to take the pawn or the knight is just to open up our king area because he doesn't want to castle maybe we hang fire with that i'm just bringing the knight here bishops attacking the bishop for now trying not to ooh, get a free bishop or is it free? What's the trick? So look like they've gone a little bit crazy now. So pawns protecting. So if he takes, takes. So I'm gonna open up his king area. I didn't think he was castling king side. So we do have this queen does is on the white square. That's not on the dark square. Damn it. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. pawn can protect there, so I think if we move here with the check on the king, still protecting the knight, well, the pawn, but we can't do anything anyway. If he does take pawn, takes we can't then stop that activity. Swim to be a burn. It's not a finishing move, you see gonna take but that's about it and then we can take this here but it's not checkmate uh, is there something else that isn't what about this knight could this knight take this pawn if he takes it's not really much is it hmm Bring the rook defending. Are we really going down that route? Oh, I'm going to take the pawn. Because there's potential for taking here. Oh, Shamali. What's happening? Let's take. Queen takes. Knight takes the pawn. Oh, and they've resigned. Yes, that went absolutely kind of crazy, but we did have our focus targeting. We had 
calculation in there um, to improve our position.